right. How's it going, everyone? My name is uh, Travis Tidwell. I'm the CTO and co-founder of a company called Form.io. I'm also going to be speaking tomorrow over the uh, mean stack and the rise of the machine. So if that sounds interesting to anyone, you can uh, listen to me speak over that. Right now, I'd like to tell you a little bit about Form.io. It's a uh, product that we're very excited to come to the market with. Uh, it's definitely a, a product that is very much in need for what is happening in the web right now, which is a, this web 3.0 movement where applications are breaking up. You have the front end applications and now they have to talk to restful backends and developers are having somewhat of a struggle to deal with this new phase of the web. And so we are coming to market with the product that we hope helps all of you solve that problem. So to state what it is that we do, Form.io provides developers this very easy drag and drop form builder interface that allows you to do two things at once. The first is to create the forms that you can use in your application. So imagine a form builder for developers. But it also does another thing. It also hooks up all of the I.O. backend that you would need for that form. So you get two things in one, one, one single shot, which is what you get with, with Form.io. At Form.io, we're all about creating what are, we're calling these next-gen web applications, which is this total separation between the front end and back end. And the front end can only communicate to the back end via RESTful APIs. And guess what? There's this amazing technology that enables that. All of you are here to talk, learn about it, AngularJS. We are very much founded in AngularJS, and our entire technology revolves around what Angular has to offer. So Form.io, what it does is it gives you this form builder. It's a very easy, intuitive form builder that allows you to create both forms and APIs. So if you think about it, as you're dragging these forms onto the form, you're essentially defining a schema. These fields can be used as a schema to define an API. And in fact, a lot of the things that you would do with an API, such as validation, Form.io gives that to you through a form builder. You can provide front-end and back-end validations through this very easy form builder workflow. And it creates both the interface and the API in one step. On the left-hand side, you have the form that you just created, which was very easy. On the right-hand side, you have this API that you can now have at your fingertips. You can use the API without the form and vice versa. It's a very flexible system. It also automatically creates API documentation through the use of Swagger IO. So this is a very uh, powerful tool that allows you to create this documentation. And with Swagger IO, you also have this code gen capabilities that allows you to build your own SDKs for that API. Here's where the magic happens. Form.io also gives you this AngularJS tag, HTML tag that we're calling Form.io. And the way that it works is just like an image tag. Once you build your form, you can use this AngularJS HTML tag, put it in your application, and that same schema renders the form dynamically and it hooks up the, the backend API. So one schema defines both the form and the API in one step. It's very powerful. And also keep this in mind, if you have a, a millions of deployments of your mobile application, instead of having to redeploy your app through the App Store, you can just change your forms in Form.io and automatically all those forms will update because the forms dynamically render. So all of you are used to dealing with this. This is the HTML form tag that all of you have come to love and hate at the same time. It's very cumbersome. You not only have to build out the form, build out the interface, but you also have to worry about hooking up some form of backend behind it. Form.io is essentially taking that form tag, adding IO, which is how we get our name, Form.io, and giving you this Form.io tag where you can provide the source to dynamically render the form and build the API at the same time. And on top of that, we allow you to build your own app. So we're, we're a developer tool. You build the app, we handle the Form.io. And what that means is you can use your favorite tools like Yeoman generators, and you can build this app. And anywhere where you would normally put the Form tag, you now put this Form.io tag, and everything just magically happens. It's a very powerful tool at your fingertips. So just to take an overview look at what Form.io provides, we have the, both the front end and the back end API solution. The front end is what I just described with the AngularJS HTML tag, and the back end is the Form.io hosted uh, services. 
I think it's now appropriate to also let you know that the, the entire API platform, we are going eventually, uh, we're getting very close to releasing that as open source. And what that means is, is you can host the API platform, it's a Node.js library, on your own servers, hook it up to your own database and control essentially your own API platform, your own data and the like, and just use Form.io for the rendering and the form management capabilities. So let's build something with Form.io. Thank you very much. What, just one more thing, uh, we are in private beta.